What's going on, people? All of our TV, uh, we're gonna wrap up the Ten Commandments. Uh, all of our Ten Commandments. My goal was to let you guys know, like, the ten kind of principles and most important things in my life. Uh, they're not in any particular order, by the way, so um, I'm gonna run through them. Well, actually, let me go ahead and give you the tenth. We gotta give you the tenth. Uh, the tenth is kind of a culmination of all of the print all, all of the commandments and the tenth commandment for Arlamar is joy and happiness like you have got to find the things in life that make you happy and do them like go for today um, for anybody what is a happy life for you I want you to write it down. I would prefer you put it in the comments below. Um, but what is a happy life for you? Please don't be vague. I I'm serious. Like, please don't tell me just have your bills paid. I guarantee you that wouldn't make you happy. You'd have your bills paid and then you would want more. So please give me the things that you need to make a happy life and don't tell me you don't need anything because you do a lot of y'all are scared to want something because you don't want to be rejected but it's character building to go out and attain these things or, or even striving for them and even when you don't get them you enjoy the journey so the tenth commandment is happiness and joy so i really want y'all to think about that uh what is it that makes a happy life for you? Uh, now, I'm gonna go through, I'm cheating, looking at my list, but the 10 commandments for me were number one is health. You gotta be healthy before you do anything. That's why it was number one. Number two was family. You gotta be healthy to serve your family, to enjoy your family, to spend time with your family. Uh, you know, you gotta have the health first, but then family, the people who are responsible for who you are. And that includes friends too. Like some of y'all are closer to friends. Uh, so enjoy your friends, definitely. Especially the ones that are like family. So do that. Number three is passion. Live a life of passion. Live a life of purpose driven towards uh, a goal. A goal. Not necessarily a goal. Passion and goal is different. It's two different things. A goal is I want to weigh 200 20 pounds one day but passion is uh just being healthy and helping other people live healthy lives that's kind of an ongoing forever type type of thing um so number three is passion number four is relationships always build new relationships in order to go to new levels you have got to go find new relationships yeah you i know you comfortable with your friends and your family but it's time to go find some other people that can take you to the next level where you are right now as a result of your relationships uh next one knowledge always be seeking knowledge always want to know the truth and the truth is evolving um whether you're talking about your beliefs or your morals that shouldn't be something that's static should be something that you're after in pursuit of every day uh just learning wanting to learn more um then we get into confidence more knowledge leads to confidence you got to have confidence to live a life of happiness and joy um but having that knowledge of things especially if you want to specialize in something that gives a person like extreme confidence so that's why it's cool to find your passion and then get all the knowledge you can about it and then you'll be confident. See, these kind of lead into each other. Um, but even once you get that confidence, then you apply discipline to confidence. Because number, uh, where were we at? Seven. Number seven is discipline. Once you apply that discipline to that talent, to that passion, to that, to that confidence you got, then the sky's the limit. So discipline. After discipline, we've got creativity. Again, don't get static, get creative. Uh, get creative with your life, get creative with your passion. Find new ways to do your passion. Find new goals inside the same passion. Gotta be creative, think outside the box. That's why you need new relationships, different people to be around, uh, to pour into you that'll spark that creativity or you can just feed off them. Number nine, forgiveness. In this pursuit of happiness and joy, you're gonna mess up. You're going to fall down. You're going to disappoint people. You're going to disappoint yourself. But do not get stuck there. Forgive. I don't care who it is. Forgive. Forgiveness is for you, by the way. Forgive yourself. 
forgive other people and move on. It's really that simple. Uh, and the last one, if you do all of those things, you'll experience happiness and joy. So this has been Arlamar TV. Um, it's bright outside. Still got some more beautiful October days left before the cold comes running in. I love y'all, man. This is Hip Hop Empowerment with the Hip Hop Intellectual and your boy 1R, 2Ls. I love y'all. Peace and love.